Welcome to Pressure Crisp. My name is Lisa. Today we're going to be using the oven whole roasted. We're going to air roast a whole chicken, but we're going to barbecue it. We're using my favorite. Yeah, this is my favorite rub right now um, to buy. Uh, it's the Grillmates Applewood. Super good. Yeah, we're going to do the Grillmates Applewood rub on the chicken and then we're going to end up at the end. We're going to put barbecue sauce on and then we're going to use the broil function to make sure it's like it's just like cooked on there and delicious and bubbly. Yeah, I know, look at me. It's all about the food, baby. Yeah, so come on over, let's get this chicken started. We're gonna turn it on. The function we want to, let's air roast. And yeah, it's set to an hour and a half. We're actually, you know something, let's just leave it on an hour and a half. Now it does say to use rack level three. We're not going to do that. We're going to use the bottom rack right there down at the bottom. And I'm going to hit start. I just want to preheat this right now while we're preparing the chicken. And I should have mentioned this is a 6.03 pound chicken. Let me cut the string off first. So I, cause I'm going to tie his little legs together. So I'm just making a quick knot here. This is, this is how I do it. I don't know if it's right or wrong, but this is the only way I really know how to make a knot. There. I'm going to cut off probably more string than what I need. I prefer to have too much than not enough. And I do want to cut a bit of butter here. I'm just cutting off tablespoons of butter for underneath the breast meat. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to try to keep one clean hand and one contaminated hand. I'm going to take some of the seasoning. You can pick it up and get it really like into the cavity. Now I'm going to do what I usually do, which my hands, I'll have to go wash my hands after I do this. I am just separating the skin from the breast meat. I usually make a compound butter, but I think what I'm going to do today, I'm just giving this a try. I haven't tried it out yet. Make sure all the paper's off, first of all. I'm going to put the butter right on top. Oh, there's a piece of paper. Jeez. Yikes. I'm just going to take this seasoning and put it right all over the butter, right on top. There we go. I'm going to take that tablespoon of butter and I'm just going to put it right under the skin, just like that. I'm going to put one tablespoon on the other side as well. What I'm going to do now is just take the seasoning and just put it all over this bird. I should have picked it up first and did the other side first, but that's okay. We're not going to add too much to this, the back side of him, but I would like to hit the sides. Uh oh, we're running out of seasoning. I'm trying not to touch him. And I am very heavy handed with the seasoning. You don't have to be, you don't have to use as much as I do. Just take the rest of it out. I did open this other one. I am just going to check to see if I missed any areas like his wings. And like I said, you don't have to be as heavy handed as me. It's, it, it's all up to you. Now I am going to take some avocado oil. Oh yeah, guys, a quick note. If you order more than one of these, this is what I do. I put an A and a Sharpie to say that stands for avocado. The other one is actually olive oil, so I put an O on the bottom of that one. Just a, I don't know, helpful hint, I guess you want to say. There. Beautiful. Now what we are going to do, like there's some missing here. Let me see if I can get a little bit of seasoning there. No, I just love this seasoning. I truly, truly do. I can't believe I'm adding more. Okay, Lise, you got to stop. Yes. All right, let me go wash my hands. And we're just going to quickly tie up his legs. I always say him. Please, people, I know it's a hen. It's a girl, but I just call it him. It's like, it's like what I call my car on my SUV. It's a, it's a him. All right. Yeah, we cut way too much string, but that's fine. So I am just going to go and... Yeah. Oops, get in there. There we go. 
gonna snip it. I think I washed my hands a hundred thousand times. Well, not literally, but it just seems that much. Oh, look, there's a bare spot. All right, you guys can tell me I'm out of control. That's fine, but I do. I love this seasoning. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so the oven, yeah, it's been preheating for about six minutes. In a second, forgot, we're gonna use the meter app. And I have a bad habit of doing this. I don't set it up until after the bird's actually in the oven because I tend to forget. I'm going to try to put this right into his thigh as best I can here. All right, so it's been preheating now for seven minutes. We're going to open it up. You put this lovely guy right in here. Okay. I'm going to bump this back up the time. Whoops. Hour and 30 minutes. I don't think it's going to take that long, but I am curious to see. Let me grab my phone so we can set up the meter up. Set this up. We're going to hit it. We're going to hit tap set up cook. We're doing poultry. We're doing chicken. We're doing whole chicken. 165. So we're going to start cook. We have about, whoops, the microphone's underneath my jacket because I'm chilly willy. We have about six minutes left. You know something? This is beautiful. Yeah, I just figured I'd give you an update. I've been looking at it. So I figured you'd want to look at it too. It's telling me it's done and time to remove it. Oh, wait, we still have to do the barbecue sauce. Totally forgot. So I'm going to actually stop it. Oh, wait, let me get ready here. So it's saying to remove from heat. Gonna open it. Oh boy, you guys have to see this. Yeah. I am gonna do, before we actually put barbecue sauce on it. Sorry, Mr. Chicken. This is 148. Hang on a second here, peeps. Yeah, it's saying it's like 130, 137 here. What the heck? 142. Yeah, it's saying this, this, this guy is not done. Huh. The meter's saying it's done. It's probably poor placement on my part. That's what I'm thinking. Huh. Check the breast. Yeah, it's 148. Yeah, this guy is not done. We're gonna let it cook longer. Turn it back on. I'm gonna hit start. The meter's saying it's done. It's not done. I probably didn't place the thermometer correctly. And this is why we have re backup. Redundancies in place to check. Yeah, I'm going to come back like in 15 minutes to see if this chicken's done. So we have about 15 minutes left on that hour and a half cook time. Let's see where we are at. All right. Stab this guy. Yeah, buck 49. Let me check the breast part. Oops. It says it's 155. Turn the lovely light on. We got two minutes left. All right, it's 159. Carry over should bring it up to 165. Let's um. Hmm. Yeah, let's put some barbecue sauce on this. Oops, this guy. All right, let's get a little bit more sauce here. Actually, I'm not gonna do the wings because my father likes those super crispy. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna taste test this and then it's go right, going right down to my father. Oops. Let me grab my mitts. What I'm gonna do is, um, and be careful. Like somebody on the Facebook group said, I think it was David. David said, and he is right, these things, because there's no stop like in a regular oven, so these could slide right out. 
the um, trays. So just please be careful with that. Just about done here. And we are using Sweet Baby Rays. Now, I really like this one. I like Stubbs, too. I like Sweet Baby Rays and Stubbs. Those are like my two favorite barbecue sauces right now. Okay, look at this beauty. We're going to push this guy back in. Now what we're going to do, we're actually going to, I'm going to stop it first off. I'm actually going to, we're going to hit function. We're going to bring this to broil. Now we're going to have to pay attention to this. We're going to put it on high and we're going to hit start. I did this video and now uh, the microphone, I don't know, it died. Uh, I'll see if I can do a voiceover. Ah, Dios mío. Oh, well, it could be worse. Could be worse, people. Could be worse. Well, at least you don't have to listen to me running my mouth. Ooh, this is going to be proved dangerous. I want you guys to see this up close and personal. And, yeah, I'm going to put it down because it's, like, super heavy. Going to show you the piece of chicken. Whoa. Super moist. I'm going to do that taste test. Mmm. I love that applewood smoke. Stop. Okay, stop. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to go back and do a partial voiceover because one of the microphones died. I can't believe it. Um, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. And, yeah, stay tuned for more videos. Sorry, guys. Mmm. Good.